few minutes. The Paulding County Sheriff is asking for support and prayers this morning after one of his deputies was killed in the line of duty. Deputy Brandon Cunningham was one of two law enforcement officers who responded to a domestic dispute in Hiram's Harmony Creek subdivision just after six o'clock last night. Authorities say they were immediately met by gunfire. This is something that has never happened in the history of the Paulding County Sheriff's Office. We have never lost a deputy in the line of duty. SWAT teams from different law enforcement agencies showed up and provided backup. Deputies learned the female victim of the domestic situation had gotten out of the house and came back to tell them she was shot. At last check, she is stable in the ICU. After an hours long standoff, the sheriff's office says the suspect took his own life. This morning, we are learning more about the deputy who was killed. Atlanta News first reporter Asia Wilson is live in the Harmony Creek subdivision near Hiram. Asia, we're also seeing what's left behind after that deadly encounter. Yeah, good morning, Megan. Such a sad situation to see. Actually, people have been stopping nonstop just to look at the home. You can see the devastation that remains here. Window shot out as well as the front door boarded up. Now, the entire situation has left the community shaken, especially the Paulding County Sheriff's Office. So much sadness and heartache after the Sheriff's Office lost 30 year old deputy Brandon Cunningham. Now, according to the department, he started working with the Paulding County Sheriff's Office in 2020. That's about four and a half years. Now, he's been in the Uniform Patrol Division for about two years. Many who work with him say he was such a good young man, adding that this one cuts deep as the Paulding County Sheriff's Office has never lost a deputy in the line of duty. Now, they're relying on the community's support and strength for the days ahead. Unfortunately, it appears as if uh, our deputies were ambushed. And so, um, it's as the sheriff stated, uh, this is a tremendously tragic situation. Our hearts are broken. You see us holding it together, but there are going to be, there is already heartache. There's already tears. And back out here live, we've been speaking with people who live in the neighborhood. They'd say they actually saw the person who was lived here uh, just out working in this community. Meanwhile, uh, the sheriff deputy that passed away, no uh, funeral plans, memorial services have been announced yet. But according to the Paulding County Sheriff's Office Facebook page, they say more information will be provided in the coming days. We're live this morning in Paulding County. Asia Wilson, Atlanta News First. And we know he is a father of two, so people are certainly thinking of him and his family, both at home and at the sheriff's department this morning. Asia, thank you. The call the deputies were responding to was for a domestic dispute. Georgia has a domestic violence hotline. The number's right here on your screen. It's 1-800-334-2836. Someone will always be there to answer the phone. Right now, the sheriff's office is asking for patience and support at this point. But when they do share more information, be sure to have the Atlanta News First app downloaded so you can be the first to learn about it.